Alright, I'm back. Today is September 11th. It's day 54. Um, day 53 was a bust. I stayed at the shelter, Hemlock's shelter, all day because it was raining all day and it was only like 50 degrees out, so it was really cold. So I decided to take a zero there because of the weather. Didn't want to, but it was probably the right idea. Now I'm dry. It was supposed to rain all day today, but now it's looking a little better. But yeah, it sucks to stay in the shelter, but got caught up on some sleep, slept all day, pretty much. But yeah, here were uh, three other guys that stayed zeroed. Um, Grizzly, troop leader, and fire starter. <laughs> they stayed there all day. And again last night, so it was two nights with those fine people. Uh, but anyway, going over Bear Mountain today, I believe, and past Salisbury. So, yeah, 16, 17 mile day planned for the day. But anyway, day 54. Day 53 was a zero. Yeah, yeah. Well, this is the top of Mount Everett. Can't really see much. That's the clouds. But there's a nice little hill up here. But yeah, that's about it. You know, piece up out of this place now. Alright, well, now I'm at the top. Lower Ridge campsite, Savage campsite. There used to be. A fire tower up here, as you can see. It'll be foggy. Anyway, Mount Everett, uh, twenty six. But yeah, it's been very wet. I'm dodging puddles the whole time. But it rained all day yesterday, so that's pretty, pretty normal. Alright, well, that's all for now, I don't know. It's starting to clear up a little bit over this way. You can just see a little bit of mountains peeking out of the clouds over there. So, maybe we will get some views today. Alright. So after every time it rains, my trail ends up being a river. Point that down so you can see. I'm in a river. Ooh, there went most of it. Anyway, fun, fun trail like a river. Yeah, yeah. All right, we got a nice little climb here. This is Grace Mountain, I believe. I just went up Mount Everett. Not too big of a climb, but a little one. Let's go the hard way. Woo! And up into the clouds. This 
That's what I just came up right there. Yep. It's cloudy all over. Ooh, yeah, it's a steep clip I'm running along. It goes pretty far down there. I'll just keep walking along next to it like this. But yeah, going good. Three, three and a half miles in or so. We will go across into Connecticut today. I think at the bottom of this hill. Not sure. But I think at the bottom of this hill. But yeah, you just keep on following this clip right along. We'll see how far Salisbury is off the trail. If it's only like a half mile, I might run in real quick. Grab my to eat or something. But if it's more than that, I probably won't. But anyway, keep on trucking along. All right. Try to get this thing steadied. Massachusetts welcomes me. Well, I'm saying goodbye. Cross this and I'll be in Connecticut. Woohoo! Four states down, ten more to go. If I don't die going across this. Dun dun dun. Ah, welcome to Connecticut. There it is. Massachusetts Connecticut border. Woohoo! Rolling right along. But yeah, I think we walk along this uh, nice little stream here. All kinds of nice little swimming holes. Walk along that for a while and then uh, the road to Salisbury, which is only a half mile off the trail, so I might go into it. Sage Raven campsite. Yeehaw. I think I go this way. Well, so far Connecticut's uh, labeling stuff pretty good. So yeah, Sage Ravine. That was pretty cool. It's a nice little stream and everything. Alright, well, let's get to the top of Bear Mountain here, and then maybe into Salisbury. By the way, I'm passing Salisbury. If I go in, it'll only be a quick trip. Half mile off trail, so. If I walk in a half mile, walk out a half mile, add one more mile, I'm down with that for a hot meal, so. Yeah, that's about all for right now. Well, Bear Mountain's a pretty good one. Nice and steep. Probably really can't see that, but I think up there's the top though. But yeah, sitting like this for a mile or so. Just straight up. But ain't nothing that I wasn't used to before. <laughs> After a month and a half off, this one's kind of tough. But this is what all Maine was like, so ain't nothing new.
straight up. Well, fair man wasn't no joke. It wasn't very long, but it was straight up. This monument marks the hearth ground in. I don't know, I can't really read it. It's a bit faded. Bill Owen Travis. Owen Travis. That's all I can really make out. Anyway, let's check it out. That ain't much of anything, it's just a big pile of rocks. And I got a little view. This is Bear Mountain. I watched this 2300 feet. Could be a little off. Anyway, Bear Mountain. Yeah. Lots of signs. Bull Park Campsite, Brassy Shelter, Shelter, 4.7 miles is what I got to go. Alright, well, it's been nice now. Alright, got some nice views from this peak. Over there might have been where I was. Looks like a tall one. And I'm not sure. Woohoo! So, I've gone 689.2 miles. And it's 1,500 miles from Springer. So I got 1,500 miles to go still. Yeah. But anyway, I'm almost down into Salisbury. It's only a half a mile, so I think I'll walk in to Salisbury. I think it's uh, got about another mile left into Salisbury, so. And after that, I'll have like four miles left to go for the day. So, we'll see how things go. I'm tired. I don't know why I slept all day yesterday, but... Hey, whatever. I'm tired. Right there is a bobcat. He sees me. I don't know if you're ever going to be able to get close enough to see that, but it's a big cat. Hear all the birds. They're all freaking out. Well, that was cool. First bobcat I've seen on the trip. I hope I can zoom in enough on uh, when I edit it for you to be able to see that. But I guess we'll find out. But yeah, that was cool. Alright, so. Looks like we have a little bit more chicken of the woods. I 
I believe this is chicken of the woods. Some down here too. So let's uh, try some. We'll take that right there. And we'll look up a recipe and uh, identify it. This fish tastes like chicken. We'll see how that goes. Well, I'm almost to camp. There's this stone here, which is just standing here. Looks pretty odd. Somebody did a circle around it. Looks like they maintain it. It's like a throne. Can't touch it. Maybe it's good luck. All right. Well, let's continue on. I'm at the top of the hill, so the shelter's close. And then I got a half a mile walk down the hill to the shelter, which I'm not thrilled about, but I guess it is what it is. Maybe my shelter will be deserted since it's so far away from the trail. Who knows? Could be all by myself. But um, maybe I'll try to let you see what a Connecticut shelter looks like. I've heard they're pretty basic, like in uh, in Maine. Hey, little chipmunk. Hey, little chipmunk. All right, yep. Onwards and downwards to the shelter. Well, this came out to a pretty area. That's awesome. Mountains, mountains, mountains. <laughs>